Also at the same time, a local woman is being remembered today after her shocking death earlier this month. The woman's grandson and his girlfriend face charges related to homicide. But today, Eudora Gustafson is being remembered as a dedicated, history-making first responder. Eyewitness News reporter Jared Pliner is working the story live in Bristol today. Danielle, good afternoon. That's right, the town's fire department with a tribute of its own to a woman who was a trailblazer decades ago. The Bristol Fire Department's Rescue 2 carrying the body of Eudora Gustafson on the morning of her funeral at St. Michael's Church. Gustafson was one of the first women in Bristol to volunteer for the town's rescue squad over 30 years ago. A rescue squad that was there at the end of her life on Soham's Drive two weeks ago. That's when police say Gustafson's own grandson strangled and robbed her to feed his drug habit. His girlfriend is charged with stealing Gustafson's belongings. Eudora Gustafson spent years aboard the rescue, helping fellow Bristolians until an illness kept her from going on calls. She also worked as a certified nursing assistant at local nursing homes. She's survived by her husband, Mark Gustafson, her father, three children, nine grandchildren, and four great-grandchildren. Eudora Gustafson was 66. And Raymond Piva IV is charged with murder. Selena Martinez's girlfriend charged with possessing a stolen vehicle and receiving stolen goods. They await trial. Live in Bristol this noontime with East Bay Mobile Newsroom, Jared Planner, Eyewitness News.